Alright, here's just a quick video tour of my uh, chunker as it stands right now. Um, I'll uh, pull back a little bit and let you see what we're looking at here. Alright, so what we've got... Sorry, I a place to put this tripod. Uh, what we've got is a frame, so the, the gearbox from the baler has mounting bolts, two on the top, two on the bottom, and two on the side. So those are all mounted up into a frame just to hold that. Then uh, down the bottom we've just got a uh, support to that way we clear the bottom of this, and that will be uh, belt driven. And as it rotates, it will rotate like this. The cutting wheel is already cut to shape. I have shortened this arm, which came on the chunker, or came on the gearbox. I uh, shortened it, cleaned it up, and uh, this backing plate was originally square, so I'm not sure if you can see the, yeah, you can see the high spots there where I've ground it down just a little bit to make it closer to the profile here. Uh, this uh, cut edge here, is flat right up to here and then I've sharpened it for the last half a rotation pretty much until it gets to completely closed and then it's flat again and I've got about a three inch bar of flat stock there just to make sure that it's completely cut off and it leaves me some options to do what I need to do everything's welded inside and out uh, this is uh, 3 8 pipe tubing against I wanted to say 9 16 or 5 8 I don't remember which, but for the backing plate. So, very very sturdy. This is a quarter inch thick 2x4 box tubing um, on everything you see here except for this piece, which is a little narrower just to fit with the shape of the uh, gearbox. So, this corner I did not cut off because I'm going to make that into my splitter. So that when that comes around, it will actually be able to hit the wood. It will go through a groove and it will hit the wood and split it in case I need to make a bigger piece a little bit smaller. So that's, uh, that's where I'm at with this right now. Um, I'll be building the rest of the uh, frame for the anvil. I've got, to, I've got to come out here with something to uh, cut against. So that's what I'm calling the anvil. And I've got a couple more of these thick plates to make that out of. So that will be nice and sturdy. Um, it'll come out from here, and then it'll uh, come in front here. The wood, finished wood, will exit down a small ramp to right about here, and then I can uh, collect it. I can send it out a further ramp out to the ground, do whatever I need to do. And uh, like I said, this will be on a trailer, so this will be the front. It will go back from here, and then the tongue part will come forward to the truck. So this should be more or less centered. Uh, the wheels will be... Uh, wherever the center of gravity is, minus a little bit. So, anyway, that's the status of the project. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll update you further as things get further along.